Today we shall fruitfully meditate on our beloved founder Father Peter Mermier's love for the word of God. We see how he allowed the word of God to form himself into a child of God, into an effective priest, into a very impactful evangelizer in the church and moved him to be a solid founder of two zealous missionary congregations this love affair with the word of god with the daily meditation let father peter mermier into the mind of god into the mind of christ into the mind of the church and helped him to act appropriately with the divine wisdom for the world of his time Father Peter Mermier was so much at home with the word of God that it permeated his thoughts words and actions thus he became the answer to the ills of his time the havoc wrought by the French revolution his love for the word of God motivated him for a life of holiness which became the hallmark of his personal and priestly life the word of god preached by father peter mermier became efficacious in others as we read in acts chapter 5 verse 12 the apostles preaching was accompanied by signs and wonders the signs that accompanied father mermier's preaching of the word were great deliverance from false beliefs genuine conversions and embracing of holy life people returning to church teachings esteeming moral uprightness deepening of the sacramental life and reconciliation of the broken relationships he preached with enormous scripture passages he was able to preach in such an authentically anointed way that those who attended the mission were captivated without realizing it father mermier's sermons on the last judgment hell and how to carry the cross were so penetrating that it deeply shook the hearts and consciences of the listeners yes indeed on his lips the word of god became that double edged sword as in hebrew chapter 4 verse 12 his solid foundation on the word of god as a rock made him emphatically say even if you all leave I will still do it alone. I want missions. A beautiful Jewish story is relevant at this juncture of our meditation to be convinced about how the word of God is to be efficacious in us as it did in Father Mermier. One day the student came to him. Rabbi, he said, I have been right through the Bible. That's all very well, my student replied the rabbi. But has the Bible been through you? This meditation simply reinforces how Father Mermier loved the Word of God. He chewed it. He ate it. He drank the Word of God that it became a honey in his mouth and joy to his heart for the peter mermier servant of god and our beloved founder intercede for us that we your children may love the word as you did live jesus amen